In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Razer controller to PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to set up and use any Razer controller that you have on your PC. For this video specifically, I'm going to be showing you this example with new Wolverine V2 Pro. However, as long as you have any controller that is compatible with your PC, you will be able to generally follow, generally follow the same steps to connect it. So, like I said, I'm going to be showing you the steps with the V2 Pro specifically, but it should apply for most models. So, for the V2 Pro, all that you have to do is make sure that it is sufficiently charged first. If you are going to be using your controller wirelessly, then you need to ensure that it has sufficient battery. To do this, plug it in with the provided USB-A to USB-C charging cable, plug it into any suitable power source, and let it charge for a while. Once it is sufficiently charged, you will be able to use it wirelessly. If you want to use it through a wired connection, then you don't have to worry about this step. So now, if you look at the back of your controller, there might be a toggle for you to set the mode. You just have to ensure that the mode is set to PC. So if there is a toggle, make sure that it is set to PC. With this done, you will be able to connect it wirelessly by setting the connection mode toggle to wireless and now plugging in the USB wireless dongle. So, as soon as you plug the wireless dongle into any available port on your PC and you power on your controller, it will automatically pair itself up with the wireless dongle, allowing you to use your Razer controller completely wirelessly. Alternatively, like I mentioned previously, if you want to do a wired connection, make sure that the controller mode is set to wired and then use the provided USB-A to USB-C cable to plug it into your PC. Once it is plugged into any suitable USB port, it is also going to be ready to be used. So it is plug and play once again. You just have to make sure that if there are any toggles at the back of your controller, you set them up accordingly before connecting. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Razer controller to PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!